My name is Chad Malone, Hoist Gracie Jiu Jitsu Black Belt. Today we're instructing some of the DC Metro PD officers in the effective use of Gracie Jiu Jitsu to essentially do their job to control uh, suspects um, and be safer in the streets. We're doing this because it's important. We need our police officers to, to be safe, to have various techniques, proven techniques, so that they can do their job to keep us safe come and visit one of our locations. We have six different locations in the Washington DC metro area, Tacoma Park, Alexandria, Lorton, Burke, and Fairfax. In order to continue to improve these techniques, the best thing is to do, get a buddy that's gonna hold you accountable. You and that buddy, go find a gym to train at. We don't really care where you train, we just want you training jujitsu. Of course, we would love to have you at Capital MMA and Elite Fitness. Uh, appreciate you guys having us out here um, so that we can demonstrate these techniques. Um, hopefully, we can come back and, and continue to add to the great work that you guys already do for our community. My name is Officer Eric Watson. I am a Metropolitan Police Officer. I'm also a member of Capital MMA. We are here to introduce recruits and police officers to basic Gracie Jiu Jitsu. It's something that's missing from our curriculum. We are doing this because we only get 16 hours of defensive tactics in the academy, and after that, we get none. I mean, only if you're a part of a specialized unit, you can get sent out for additional training, but I felt the need for it, so pushed out a bunch of emails, and here we are. There were several situations that I saw on my own videos online, officers without the ability to handle themselves under making arrests, you support situations, so just that alone made my spider senses tingle, and then I decided to put this thing together. Been doing jujitsu five years now, and I'm currently a purple belt. I have to say I've used it at least three times in my career. And each time I got instant compliance, so the benefits of practicing, I can't say enough about it. The defensive tactics is perishable. You need to train continuously. This needs to be a constant thing where you train. For me, I train three to four times a week. I highly suggest that these guys adopt it into the police academy. That way we can train this regularly. I highly suggest that everyone find a school, come to Capital MMA, take a trial class. Take what you learned today, take it home with you, practice, 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 and it'll make you a better officer in the street. I personally want to thank my coaches, Chad Malone and Sean Carroll and Jeremy. Thank you for your support. I appreciate it. I could not have done it without you guys. The Metro PD, I'm thankful that you guys kept an open mind to this. I'm appreciative of the opportunity to have this seminar and I hope we can do it again in the future.